Alright everyone, today I'm going to be showing you how to fix stabiliser wobble of two different methods, the clip and the bandaid. For these two methods you're going to need a couple of different things. You're going to need to get yourself just any any plasters, band-aids in America, um, key cap puller, hot swap switch puller and some like heavy duty scissors for the clipping. The first thing you're going to want to do is start taking your keycaps out that have stabilisers on them, like your space bar and your back space. After you take your keycaps off, you're going to want to start taking your switches off with this switch puller. You just need to put one of both ends on the top of the switch, push in. And pull. Take stabilizers out, you're going to want to get yourself a little toothpick and right there where my finger is you'll see a little notch right here. You're going to want to push that back and pull the switch. That's going to be that part loosened. Then for the other side you're going to want to do the same thing, a little, little notch, pull. You've got them both done. And you want to just sort of fiddle with them to, it can be quite awkward to get this little metal bar out. Just start wiggling it about until it sort of comes through. And then just do that with the rest. After you take all your stabs out, you want to get your um, plasters ready. Or band-aids. And you want to cut for the size of them. Do you want to each one of them there? Go ahead and do that now. The easiest way is to get a little bit and put it on the edge of a toothpick. And then just... Going like this here and start getting it in. Make sure all the cell tips or the plasters down. Right down and put it through the edge or the bottom. See like that there? Make sure everything's below. The band-aids got them all through clean underneath. You want to take your stabilizers i'm going to show you how to disassemble to disassemble disassemble stabilizer you want to click just twist both feet until the wee metal pole pops out like that do that for both like that put that to one side then you want to take both of your side bits and you want to Push that down and let that fall at the bottom of the stem. And you want to put them two in the room. And put these two in the room as well. I clipped my stems a long time ago. But usually you will see two, one on each side here. And it will have a little hook going upwards. So it will be like that. And it will go upwards. You want to cut both of them off like I have. Like there and there, the two shorter ends. And that will just make it sound better and more stable. Sorry that I can't show, but it's already been cut. Just make sure they cut the two sides of fangs and you should be good. All your stabilizers should go in easily as long as your bandages or band-aids aren't sticking out too far. They're, they should go in smooth. And then you just need to put your switches and keycaps back on. I'll give you a sound test now. Thanks so much for watching the whole video. Really appreciate it if you subbed and liked. It really helped me out.